People often say that happiness comes in huge bundles, but it can also be very tiny that only weighs a few pounds in certain cases. The same is in the case of dogs, from mastiffs that are of the size of miniature horses to teensy teacup sized companion dogs, they surely bring us happiness in all sizes. Hey guys and welcome back to Epic Mojo, in today's video we bring you the smallest dogs in the world. But before we dive in, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. Without further ado, let's hop into it! Chinese Crested In number 10 we have the hairless breed of dog, Chinese Crested. They are perhaps the most recognizable smallest dog breed amongst every other in today's list. They have a naked body, mostly since many of these breeds are hairless. But they are not completely hairless, they have a crest of fur on their heads quills of fur on their tails and also on their feet that look like they are wearing socks. The Chinese Crested is a low energy breed. Even though they're athletic, these cuties would be very happy to spend their day curled up on the bed. They love their humans so much, they are bonded too much with their owners, they often get away from strangers and always stick to their owners. They are social but they need love and care from their owners, oh and they might even need a sweater to warm them up in the cold weather. Weather. They are about 11 to 12 inches tall and weigh around 10 to 13 pounds. The Japanese Chin Well, if you think you're a dog person who still finds yourself loving cats, then I suggest you get this cute little bundle of joy. The Japanese Chin has been in the world for more than a thousand years and is one of the oldest breeds of dogs in the world. They are a friendly and outgoing nature type of dogs. In fact, these breeds of dogs have a history of companionship. It is due to their temperament that they are considered to be cat-like. They have quite the character with the tenacity for jumping onto tall furniture to get the best view of the room, to use its tiny paws to wash their faces. These dogs have it all, with a tad bit of an independent streak adding to their character as well. Though they are friendly and family loving, they tend to be a little quiet around strangers. It can be an absolute playful dog around its active owners and be very obedient around its quiet owner. Aren't they interesting enough? This cute little comical breed is a lap dog with a height of 8 to 11 inches that weighs around 3 to 15 pounds. The Toy Fox Terrier Toy Fox Terriers are the small descendants of the Smooth Fox Terrier. However, the Toy Fox Terrier had become its own breed recently as of 2003, when the American Kennel Club recognized it. Don't let these tiny dogs fool you into thinking they are less energetic, because they have a lot and lots of energetic activity stored in their tiny little frames, much like the little powder keg. For someone who wants an active, trainable dog that can fit inside a small apartment, the Toy Fox Terrier is the perfect choice. They are also very agile, smart, fast and courageous as well. They can even be your partner on a hiking trip as well, but make sure they are on a leash since they have a high prey drive. It is a terrier after all, what else can you expect? These little ones love to play, learn and explore even though they are only 8.5 to 11 inches tall and weigh only 3.5 to 9 pounds. The Russian Toy Trust me, I haven't heard of this breed either, and I am not at all surprised if you haven't heard of it either. Originating in Russia, this dreamy little dog was unknown to the rest of the world until the 1990s. This dog breed was bred to be rather a watchdog, they are quite vocal and very loyal. They get along with every family member, including kids, and are very playful with them. They are the types of dogs that the family can treat as an actual dog rather than a toy for your family members. They are extremely bright dogs and love to train and yes, they would love a good book. The Russian toy is similar to the Chihuahua in a few ways. Like the Chihuahuas, these breeds also have two coats, a smooth one and a long coat. And their big ears would remind you of the Pampillion. Standing between 7 and 11 inches tall, the Russian toy weighs around 2 to 6 pounds. Yorkshire Terrier Did you know that the Yorkies started as ratters in Yorkshire, England? Yes, they did. But today, they have grown to become a widely adored companion animal around the world. According to the AKC, they are the 6th most popular breed of dog and the most popular toy breed of dog. 
They are widely known for their long and luxurious coats. Their coats are hypoallergenic since they shed less than other dogs. But that doesn't mean they need less grooming. In fact, grooming is essential for the Yorkies. Yorkies love to train and are well-rounded dogs. Even then, they don't really possess high energetic quality. And that's why they are perfect for someone who likes to take a long walk or two every day and then come home and cuddle up on the couch while watching TV. They aren't very fond of children or strangers and are very vocal at times. The Yorkies are 6 to 9 inches tall and weigh under 7 pounds. Papillion! It's the ears for me, guys. Ah, the name of this dog is perfect for this breed. Papillion means butterfly-eared because of their upright ears look like butterfly wings. Papillions are an absolutely friendly and self-assured breed of dogs. If they are properly socialized, they can perfectly get along with kids, strangers, and even other house pets. They are an amazing companion, even if they are less vocal. They are intelligent and very energetic. And if you want a small, cute dog that you would want to engage in smarts and speeds, then this is the best fit dog. The favorite pastimes of the Papillion are rally obedience and agility. Standing at 8 to 12 inches tall, Papillion weighs 7 to 10 pounds. I mean, look at them. Aren't they just adorable? And of course, the ears. Aww. F and Pincer. Let me guess, you haven't heard of this breed before either. Well, same, I haven't heard of this either. The Affenpinzer is a breed of dog that originated in Germany. They originated as ratters as well, to control rodents in the kitchen and stables. The breed's name translates to monkey-like terrier, since their striking familiarity with monkeys. And the French describe this little breed of dogs as mustached little devils. This is quite waggish, either way the dog oozes feistiness and personality. They are indoor dogs who love daily walks. They are protective and very stubborn as well, but then very curious and playful too. They are reckless and very fearless, also territorial, which means they don't do well with kids. However, they are quite the sassy best friend if they have the right owner. These sassy doggies standing at 9 to 12 inches tall weigh around 7 to 13 pounds. Pomeranian in number three, we have everyone's favorite, the fuzzy ball, and perhaps the most popular pet, the Pomeranian. It is all about their furs. They are literally a fluffy pom-pom. Their fur is in fact one of their most defining characteristics. Among many other breeds of dogs, Pomeranians have the most coat colors. They have 18 colors that range from black, white, to the common tan, and everything in between. Moreover, they have a combination of colors that can be spotted or brindled sometimes. They actually have double coats. The undercoat is soft, thick, and short, whereas the overcoat is long, straight, with a harsh texture. Their overcoat sheds twice a year and they need plenty of grooming, including a trim every two months. You will have to spend a lot of time grooming the pom-poms, but their extroverted and alert personalities make it all worth it. They need to be trained properly since they are territorial and can be aggressive at times. However, the Palms are extremely cute little dogs that stand about 5 to 11 inches and weigh merely 4 to 8 pounds. Brussels Griffin Yes, this one surely is an uncommon breed. These breeds of dogs were created in Brussels, Belgium, and hence the name. They are short-faced and long-legged dogs that were originally bred as a terrier that was kept in the stables to hunt down rodents. But today, they are pets every one of us would love to have. They have two main kinds of coats, a rough coat and a smooth one, and a few more different color coats. The peculiar thing about this dog is that they tend to bond with only one human, and much like many other dogs on the list today, the Brussels Griffin does not enjoy being around children. But they usually get along fine with other animals in the house and can be an ideal pet for a home with many other pets. They love to play and snuggle. These uncommon Common breeds of dogs are smart, sensitive, and a bit stubborn at times. Standing at around 7 to 8 inches tall, they weigh around 7 to 12 pounds. The Chihuahua And here we have the smallest dog in the world, the Chihuahua. Actually, there is only one breed of Chihuahua globally, but they have an amazing variation within. 
They are a low maintenance dog that don't require much grooming, but they can be a little high maintenance when it comes to training time. Much like the Brussels Griffin, the Chihuahua usually also becomes protected and devoted to a single person, making it tough when it comes to living with kids. But if trained properly, they can be an amazing family dog. These tiny little dogs have a diversity of coat colors and two head shapes, an apple-shaped head and a deer-shaped head. They are the tiniest dogs in the world that stand around 6 to 10 inches tall and weigh a feather lightweight of 4 to 6 pounds. And that's it for today's video. Which of these tiny bundles of joy are you planning to bring home for this Christmas? Let us know in the comments section down below. And don't forget to subscribe and turn on post notifications for more epic content. See you soon.